Hey everybody, Mike Cipperini here from Chippers Island Adventures and today I'm going to go over a couple of new items that I put on my RV entry door. Hey everybody, so recently I did a video on some of my upgrades and two items I forgot to add were things that I did to my entry door. So this is the first item. And so this is an RV guard, RV screen door crossbar handle. It goes for about $15 on Amazon and it's a really a nice little upgrade. And I'm gonna show you why. Now, instead of having to reach way down for the handle, you can just grab the bar and pull it in. The biggest problem that I found with this is getting in the habit of grabbing for the bar because I keep wanting to go for the handle. And yes, it does work in bringing in the whole door. So that's a lot better to do it that way. So that's a nice little upgrade. It's a pretty easy install. You are going to need a drill, a 1 8 inch drill bit, I believe, along with a Phillips head um, adapter for your drill so you can get the screws in because you're going to drill a hole and drive them in through the aluminum frame. Now, what I want to show you is basically I lined up the bottom with the curvature so you definitely want to get a you want to try to get a straight line on the bar and you can't just put a level on it because you may be off on the ground so i just basically lined it up with a couple points on the screen door and you also want to make sure you don't go all the way to the edge because it may get in the way of closing it so i came in a little bit and it worked out just fine so that's my first upgrade now the second item is this. This window, I was contemplating putting in a new window and one with a shade because I like this window to have a shade on it. But the problem is I was seeing, I didn't want to end up in the frame being a little bit smaller so I had a big gap between the decal and the window frame. And I got a little bit uh, concerned about that so i got this and this is the window shade that you can fold down just like that and it works perfect not only that you fold it back up and let's say i put it up to right here which is that's pretty much maxed out now watch the clothes is just fine. We go in. I'll go ahead and grab the aforementioned bar. That door is closed solid. So let's go ahead and open it up again. So the door closes fine with it up. Me, I tend to leave it down. I leave it down. And I've gotten in the habit of that because I'm one of those guys when I sleep, I like a dark room. And if I feel like sleeping in a little bit, and I'm talking like after 536 when the sun comes up in a lot of places, this helps keep the uh, light out really well. The nice thing is it's Velcroed on with Velcro tape. It doesn't rattle. I can always change it out. And I will tell you, I do like the idea of the window with the built-in shade. I really do. This is a viable alternative. It's from Bouge RV, who makes a lot of covers. They actually made my windshield cover. And it's called the Bouge RV RV Door Shade. So that's it. Nice little cover for your door. Very easy install. It goes for about $23.99, $24 on Amazon. 
And like I said, that is a very easy install. About the only work you gotta do is trimming the tape. And if you can see, I trimmed the Velcro tape so it's not overhanging or anything. And that's it. So that's my two door upgrades. Kind of an add on to the last video that I did on upgrades. If you like this video, feel free to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And like I always say, all the best to all and happy RVing.